What's up everybody? Just trying to do a quick video to help you guys uh, see how you refill your AC uh, with uh, refrigerant or Freon. I'm not sure what it's called. I'm pretty sure it's saying refrigerant, but I heard it's also called Freon. Uh, what you want to do is you want to buy this. It's called Easy Chill. Uh, or this refrigerant where, it, where this one actually comes with a gauge. And you're going to need this. Uh, so that you can hook it on and then this part connects to where you're going to refill the AC. The other thing that is in, that's important as well is you got to so turn on your car, pop your hood, and then right here, so as you have your car running, make sure you turn on your AC all the way up that it's running and then it's all the way cool and then make your way over to the to your hood. So this is what it looks like when you connect that gauge um, to the refrigerant device. Uh, you got to make sure it has one of these caps. I use Teflon tape right here. Uh, what that is is it helps seal this a little bit better uh, so that nothing will leak through and that you don't have to have it super tight. And then go ahead and make your way over to the hood. So then the next step is you got to, there's these two things right here. Uh, one has an H and one has an L. You can actually use the one that has an L. And remove that cap real quick. You're going to just go ahead and plug that in right there. Just like that where it can't come off. Then you're going to go ahead and remove this cap and then just start going in. So see right now it's saying I'm okay. I could use a little bit more. Um, but it's on the blue and here's the paper right here that says where you should have it at so the blue means it's good right now it's just a little bit over 25 like you use a little bit colder you just go ahead and remove that cap and then start pressing down so then after you're done you got to make sure you shake it shake it well and then go like this and you're good to go when you're done go ahead and remove this tighten that cap back up right now this and there, see it's ready. Go back in the front and see if it's cold. Hey guys, I just showed you that little clip of how to do it just because I know that uh, taking this into a shop it can cost anywhere from a hundred to three hundred bucks. If you're lucky, maybe a hundred and fifty. I don't know, maybe now it's cheaper. But this, these two things were fifteen and and twenty, so that's thirty five bucks. Um, I showed you how easy it is now the air is blowing cold and hopefully I fixed it without having to go to a mechanic shop um, but I'll always say rec I recommend you just um, if you're uncomfortable with doing it and you don't care about money then go ahead and just take it to a mechanic shop but it's that simple a few minute video just to show you guys how to do it and get it done by yourself save you guys a couple hundred dollars um, I didn't know how to do it at first this was my first try and the air is cold so Hopefully that helps, guys. Peace.